And we're back. Sorry about that. Anubis needed a walk. What do I need here? Okay, I'm gonna send these two out again. Just go for that Excellent. Tech Excellent. I was just wondering what I could do to please you. Anubis, do not do that. Uh, and immediately he just starts crying again. If it becomes too much today, what I will do is um, record at night and just play my uh, I'm going to haunt you. my finished Jedi Knight. Cause she does have dailies to do now. I hate dailies. I actually try to avoid the dailies. He's right here. Out of range, the game says. Fuck that, I say. <sighs> Yay. I'm in my own little area so I can kill as much as I please. Yeah, don't try to kill my partner. It it usually ends badly for you. Actually I'm gonna go for this one because she's in the middle. And drop a jelly bomb. Jelly. I'm gonna move the mic down a little bit because I'm breathing in too much. With my whistly nose breathing. At least I think I am. I'm not 100% sure. I just know it would drive my friends crazy. Oh, there we go. He's dead. There's no reason to not kill everyone in these things. Like all in all, it's better if you do. Where are you? You're under the bed. Why do you keep crying? Sweetie, go play. And don't push things on my keyboard. Oh, that was some lag. It's like those, uh... Those animes where the hero cuts someone in half and they're standing there for a couple seconds afterwards like, what just happened? He's in that direction, so I'm gonna go in this direction because I can. Like, there is nothing I hate worse in games than inadvertently going the right direction when I'm trying to like explore and get everything. It is the worst feeling ever. Oh. Oh. Hmm. This voice sounded vaguely familiar. This always does the trick.
that I'm clicking attacks rather than uh, numbering them. I find that my fingers are kind of spastic sometimes. So maybe for me it's, you know, easier to click and push numbers. There we go, he's finally calmed down. What was going on was he needed a walk and also he, uh... Why are you in a cage? Pipe down, Dormat. There's something going on outside. I'm trying to listen. Oh, come on, Six. Throw me a bone. Who's this agent that's coming to interrogate me? At least answer me that, will you? Fine, fine. Stay clamped. I don't care who it is, I ain't talking. Nobody's gonna get nothing out of me. Nothing! Is Ensign, like, private or something? Mm. I'm trying to remember. What? Oh. All right, all right, I ain't proud, I give. My dad's an Imperial agent. What did you say? Your dad is a what? Yes, please repeat that, Junior. Oh, oh, oh no. <laughs> this is a restricted area. What are you doing here? Who are you? It's not a who, it's a what. It's a Sith. He's going to need a new pair of pants. <laughs> Who cares what Dermot needs? You gave me enough time to get what I need. Ugh. I have a very bad feeling about this. Save the game. Take a look behind yourself, Sith. That's what two squads of the Republic's finest looks like. Eight people. <laughs> Not for long. Oh, <laughs> that's dirty! That is dirty! <laughs> or, or maybe I'm dirty. Finally, a fight worthy of me. Come on, men. Let's send this Sith home in a body bag. Oh, shit. Bastard. That's right. I fucking thought so. Oh, I can't interrupt that? Oh, because I was too late. Ha! Huh. Why can't I kill this person? All right, dumbass. Zix? Zix? Come on, talk to me, Zix. Get up, man. Look at me, Ensign Dermat. But if I don't look, then... Maybe you're not really here. <laughs> oh, blast, I looked. It's like a moose. Please. Please, I, I know why you're here. The, the Republic. The Republic's investigating my dad, and, and an agent's coming to put the screws to me. But I won't break. I promise. L let me live. My, my dad's secret is safe with me. I'm, I'm a rock. You are full of it. You'd crack the minute someone looked at you funny. I just heard you confess to Six. Yeah, but he's, he's dead now, so he, he can't tell anyone. My father's done so much for the Empire. The, look, may, maybe the apple fell off the tree. I mean, kind of far from the tree, but it's still... Look, the apple's still... Look, I'm, I'm not exactly sure where I was going with that, but please, please don't kill me. I'm willing to consider alternatives. Is there another solution? Hold on. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I just had a thought pop into my head. Just quick, before it pops out. My assignment here was in the medical lab. Moving supplies and, and making deliveries. And the docs there were working on something really cool. Okay. It, it was a drug that was supposed to create temporary amnesia, but it wiped the mind totally clean. The test subjects didn't even know their own names. 
So you want me to wipe your mind? Wow. You force users really can read thoughts. You spelled it out. Yeah. You, you, you could break into the lab and, and bring back the drug. I'll overdose and, and not know nothing no more. That way my dad's secret identity's safe. You'll be getting a second chance at life. I've never had a second chance before. The med lab's in the back building. The head doc kept a small supply of the drug in his footlocker. I'll, I'll wait right here. Like I have a choice. <laughs> yeah, you don't. Ooh, sweet. Now it's Excellent. just lock boxes for everyone. I was just wondering everyone. what I could do to please you. Yeah, just go. My god, shut up, 2v, alright? Is it in this building? Awesome! And I already killed everyone here. Sweet. It's not a bad idea. You know, it might be the light side thing to do, but eh. Amnesia serum. Hey, kid. Let's see, and, and there was a time I almost shot myself in the foot. That was a close one. What else? Oh, you're back. I was just recalling my life, trying to remember the highlights since I'm about to have my memory wiped clean. I think I'm done. Not much to reflect on. So, did you get the drug? I'm actually looking forward to starting over. Get it right Try not time. to screw up your new life. At least if I do, hopefully it'll be in new and more exciting ways. Here goes nothing, I guess. Uh, uh. Uh, who are you? Who I am is inconsequential. Who are you? I... I have no idea who I am. Do, do you know? Can you tell me? Decide for yourself who you're gonna be. Don't let anyone tell you who you are. Goodbye. Oh, so... Well, so long then. Thanks for stopping by. Wow. Too bad there isn't more of that drug. I got a few memories I could let go of. <laughs> Don't we all? I'll tell you. I'd like to forget the smell in here. Let's move on, shall we? Okay, go back to him. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna teleport back to the city. I should have gone to the cantina. Never mind. Let's go to the cantina. Because she needs to talk to us anyway. Mm. Sorry if that was audible. I need some tea. Ready, vet? What's up? Have you ever heard of Noc Drayen? Pirate. Terrified the criminal world for a few decades. It's gonna get wars, right? He destroyed the Wrath Cartel and the Vandalhelm Combine in some giant power grab. Same guy? Yeah, same guy. Weird to think of him that way. Noc Drayen was the most famous killer in the galaxy. But he set me free. I was still slaving it up for three eyes when he crossed Nock. Or maybe he just had something Nock wanted. I never did ask. I assume he died. Did any of the gang survive the encounter? You mean anyone that wasn't owned as property? No, they did not. I'm still not sure how Nock got his speeders into the camp. One minute they weren't there, 
And then they were. He was ruthless, but not a thug, you know? Sort of a pirate prince. Freed all the slaves, and told them they could join up, or go their own way. I assume you saw the opportunity for plunder, and seized it. Well, I wasn't gonna go wander off on whatever waste of a planet we were on. <laughs> I was the smallest on the crew, and mining had taught me to fit in tight spaces. Nox crew showed me how to steal. For a long time, I didn't feel bad about stealing. So much had been taken from me. It must have been hard for you. Well, it's a long time ago anyway. Let's get back to work, yeah? Sure, kiddo. Excuse me. I just walked right through that guy. I just thought of some Sword Art Online bullshit. Damn. I haven't even seen an episode of that anime and it's like, oh. The results are much better than they appear, Master. You'll see. That's fine, just go again. Like, quit coming back to tell me about this crap and just go. I will perform according to your exacting specifications, Master. Oh my god, I hate you both so much. Hey, Lieutenant, come and talk to me. What's up? I must be honest. Your success at the Satellite Control Station and Republic Crater Outpost has surprised me, my lord. I computed the likelihood of success as nearly negligible. In my assessment, however, Mole. I only considered the capabilities of a typical Sith. Clearly, you are not a typical Sith. Mole. I will adjust future calibrations to account for your unprecedented abilities. Oh my god, I always choose the flirt! Quinn, you know just what to say. I'm not too proud to acknowledge when I'm mistaken. Lord Barris is pleased. He says it's time to zero in on your prime directive, and he awaits your contact. My barracks are yours. Activate the hollow communicator in the next room to speak with Lord Barris. The line is secure. You've been most helpful. I'll be right here if needed, my lord. I always choose the flirt. Ooh, a new, uh, a new shirt. Awesome. Now we have a new look. Where the hell is your room? Hey, Barris, how's it going, asshole? I hope you can see the smile on my face, Apprentice. You are turning me into a true believer. I can't believe it. Wait a minute, let me pinch myself. I'm sure you're impatient to complete your time on that little rock. Yeah. With the satellite tower computer destroyed, and Commander Rylon's son neutralized. My spy's tracks are covered. Good. Now the only threat to Rylon ever being exposed is the man himself. It's time to end that threat. Permanently. Do I have a choice in the matter? I like that idleness makes you disagreeable. Just mm -hmm. be sure to give Commander Rylon an honorable death. It's the least we can do. I've had him embedded within enemy ranks for decades. The extent of his contribution to the Empire's interests is unrivaled. 
It's time to retire him. He served his purpose. You took the words right out of my mouth, apprentice. The Jedi Investigator must have no hard evidence that Rylon was killed to silence him. It must look like anything but a targeted execution. Annihilate everyone there. Oh, so just exactly what I always do. An apprentice's work is never done. Be glad of that. When I stop giving you work, you should be worried. I've summoned Lieutenant Quinn. He'll prepare you for your final task. Oh, is he coming with me? Your final target is the Balmoran Arms Factory. The Resistance forces recently captured it and made it their headquarters. An incursion into the Arms Factory will be a monumental feat. I'm excited by the prospect of you laying waste to that place. Nice choice of words you got there. So, I excite you, do I? <laughs> well, what I meant was, when I imagine all the ways you will shape the galaxy, I get very excited. Yes. How easily you fluster, Lieutenant. Well, my lord, your question was a bit surprising. My mind is on the task at hand. Sure it is. Sure it is. It's called multitasking, Lieutenant. Look into it. I am always interested in bettering myself, my lord. May I continue to brief you on the Balmoran Arms Factory? No. I reserve the right to readdress this issue in the future. That is your prerogative, of course. All right. <laughs> I'm such a troll! The Republic Command Center <laughs> is deep inside the arms factory, the most heavily protected installation on the planet. In order to reach Commander Rylon, you will have to make your way past all of the factory's defenses, which are considerable. I like a challenge. The tougher, the better. Stationed inside are an estimated 1,000 of the Republic's best trained soldiers. Ooh. Specifically, Rylon's elite squadron is responsible for some of the most precise, improbable resistance victories on Balmora. They're legendary. I hate them already. I'll feed off that. Oh. The Empire's cause here on Balmora will be greatly advanced once they're gone. One final thing. The investigator that the Jedi sent has been concentrating her activity around the arms factory. I have her under minute-by-minute -minute surveillance. If she becomes a problem, I'll contact you on your comlink. Sounds like a plan. I'm on top of it. I will be here to salute you when the Balmoran Arms Factory is a smoking husk, my lord. Cool. Commander Rylon. Let's see what he looks like. He's old! Let's go kill him. Your final directive is within your grasp, my lord. I trust you'll be heading to the Balmoran Arms Factory soon. There were complications, Master. Please don't deactivate me. Oh wow, you both failed. Excellent. I was just wondering what I could do to please you. That's actually kind of a first. Oh, time to get on a plane. We're going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship, flying through the sky. Holy crap, how old am I? What day is it? It's the 4th of January. I'm almost 24. Why is that? Wow. Wow, brain. Displaying okay. all authorized destinations. Just you do that, brain. Good lord. I wonder how this is going to go wrong. Like, seriously, something is going to go wrong.
quest. Okay then. It's this direction. My lord, you're Darth Barriss's apprentice, right? Got yeah. orders from the planetary governor to find you. You're needed at this war conference, Priority Alpha One. What's going on? Why does the Balmoran governor need me? The Dark Council sent an emissary, big time Sith Lord, to personally review the status of the Balmoran occupation. This conference will determine the next stage of the ground campaign. Whole war's about to be decided, and the governor wants your expertise. This emissary of the Dark Council, what do we know about him? Sith politics aren't my business. One of Darth Maul's servants is what I hear, but don't know anything else. Assigning black level clearance. No one will cause you trouble. Be quick though. They're starting any minute. The hell? All right then, whatever. I think they're down here. Yeah. Colonel Baron. My lord, let me be the first to tell you how appreciated your work has been. Today the Balmoran resistance, backed by the government in exile, takes its last pitiful gasp. We have you to thank. It won't be long before the corpse of former defense minister Vol Argon is cold in the ground. Sorry. Has the former defense minister come to Balmora? That's the rumor, but either way, if Operation Breaking Point succeeds, his death is only a matter of time. The Resistance, aided by the Republic, has made its headquarters in the Balmoran Arms Factory. It is a heavily fortified facility, but it's not invulnerable. Not with such a powerful patriot as yourself on our side. I'm pleased that you have such confidence in me. If we may impose on you for one final task in service of the Glorious Empire, we need you to break into the factory, shut off its power, and use the period of panic to shut down security. Once this is done, the main attack force can sweep in and wipe out the resistance. And if you see Vol Argon, kill him. Fun, this fun. will be like terrorizing children. Well, that's not Perhaps, nice. Perhaps, but I wouldn't go in too overconfident. Word is, the Resistance at the factory have the Republic's backing. They'll be well-equipped and well-trained. For anyone else, this would be a suicide mission. I wouldn't consider it, but I have a good feeling about you. on a trip and our favorite rocket ship flying to the sky oh come on stupid elevator there's the door I don't care that it's yellow, they're both going on it. Mm. Do you know the worst part, Governor? <laughs> I didn't! I, I didn't! Exactly. You didn't even own up to your mistakes. 
That's why the Dark Council gave this planet to me. Put the man down. Put him down now. So much confidence. Such a commanding voice. Who's calling? So, <laughs> thank you, my lord. I think I like it. I'm Darth Lacris, and I've been tasked with cleansing Balmora. I'm glad you came. More Sith can only bring much needed dignity. Cut to the I chase. don't care if you rule one planet or a thousand. Nobody wastes my time. To business, then. You're here because I asked the governor to bring me his best. Balmora has a problem. My friends of the Resistance, I won't take much time. The Empire says it owns Balmora. The Republic says it's yours. We're gone. But you and I know Balmora's one with sweat and tears. And my boys will stand by your side until everyone knows it. Grand Marshal Jaqueta, formerly of the Republic Army. Officially, he and his troops went rogue after the Republic withdrew from this sector. Ever since, they've been holed up under siege, aiding the Resistance and fortifying their position. You may have met their scouting parties already. If these men are ex-Republic, aren't they violating the peace treaty? Oh goodness, Not so long me. as the Republic government denies any official involvement. Jaqueta and the Resistance are based in the Balmoran Arms Factory, home of the brightest engineers in the galaxy. I'm told the factory's generators are inexhaustible, its defenses cutting edge, its barricades block our scans, giving the Resistance peace and privacy. We can't hurt them, but they can't hurt us while they're contained in there. And what if they stop being contained? Jaqueta may have officially gone rogue, but the Republic still supports him. They fund his revolution from the shadows, make supply drops in secret. Those Republic hypocrites want the arms factory as a beachhead. And as Balmora's new governor, I say we take it before they mount a full invasion. I think you're being paranoid here. You don't know the Republic is planning an invasion. You don't even know they're behind Chiquetta and his men. It is my judgment. And either way, Balmora is threatened. Obliterate the factory defenses. Lower the barricades that block our scans, and I'll have an army at your back. And if you can, bring me proof of Republic involvement on Balmora. We'll expose their lies on a galactic stage. Oh, level 20. Are over there. Okay. That's kind of sad. Do I need to go back upstairs? Really? Yeah, I need to go back upstairs. Huh. This one. Keep going. No. This one.
up we go. Trying to follow the road. And here we go. New map area. Master, I deliver to you something beyond perfection. You deserve nothing less. I will perform according to your exacting specifications, Master. Nobody better mess with us now. And they're dead. Open this. Marshal Takeda to all personnel. Last night was a hell of a fight. Outnumbered ten to one, and we still beat back the imps. Victory's coming, boys. Keep this up, and we can all go home. This place is immense. Something tells me we're gonna be here for a while. Yeah, there are quite a few quests in here. This is a lore thing? No, it isn't. Not cool. Alright guys, I'll be back in a second.